Independence Day, July 4th, 2024. Tradition and Customs On July 4th, the United States celebrates Independence Day. It is a legal holiday. It is called Independence Day because on July 4th, 1776, the Continental Congress declared that the United States of America would become free and independent from England. Many activities are organized to celebrate this holiday. All across the America, firecrackers are exploded and fireworks are displayed. They symbolize the gunpowder of the American Revolution. Bands play patriotic marches in parade. Politicians make speeches about freedom and American ideas. These are patriotic readings and music at various parks. People organize street fairs. Planes from the Air Force perform acrobatics in the air. Picnics, clam, bake, clam bakes, and barbecues are very popular activities on this day. Many families and friends celebrate the day at beaches, pools, and baseball games. The lights of the Empire State Building in New York City display the colors of the American flag, red, white, and blue. In Monticello, Thomas Jefferson's home in Charlottesville, Virginia, Independence Day is observed with a naturalization ceremony. Immigrants are sworn in and become U.S. citizens. In Boston, the birthplace of the American Revolution, the force is celebrated with an outdoor musical performance. The Boston Pops Orchestra plays popular and patriotic music on the banks of the Charles River. The concert ends with cannons joining the orchestra and Tchaikovsky's 1812 Overture as fireworks explode over the river. Background In 1773, there were 13 English colonies in America where more than 2 million people lived. England owned and governed the colonies. England tried to collect more money from the colonies by passing tax laws. These taxes made the Americans very angry. They said it was not fair for England to make them pay taxes that they did not vote the own. The Americans say no taxation without the representation. One of the most hated taxes was a tax on tea. When three English ships loaded with tea docked in Boston Harbor, some Americans dressed as Indians threw all the tea into the water. This became known as the Boston Tea Party. England sent soldiers to America to foster colonists to obey English laws. English soldiers killed Americans in what is called the Boston Massacre. It was finally decided at the Continental Congress that Americans should declare their independence. The Congress chose Benjamin Franklin, John Adams, Robert Livingstone, and Roger Sherman to work on this idea. Thomas Jefferson was chosen to write the Declaration of Independence. It was signed on July 4, 1776. Copies of the Declaration of Independence were read throughout the colonies. In Philadelphia, the Liberty Bell was rung to call the people to hear the reading. After seven years of war with England, the American colonies finally won 
and were recognized as a united independent nation.